I don't care about Harry Potter. I'm not getting this game because I don't like Harry Potter. I don't like the movies. I don't and I don't read books, so I can't tell you about the books. But I don't really care for the Harry Potter movies. I watched the Fantastic Beast movies, and the second one sucked, so I didn't watch the third one. I don't like Harry Potter that much. But I don't like Harry Potter because I think that Harry Potter is an extremely overrated movie series, an extremely overrated story, not because of what the creator of Harry Potter said. For, you know, it's just I have never been into Harry Potter. Basically, that's my explanation of this. I have never been into Harry Potter. But the whole hate for the new Harry Potter game, you cannot enjoy the new Harry Potter game. And here we go. We are playing Hogwarts Legacy. 60. anti tans creator. No mass. I don't know what mass means. Ugh. Reading Massel. 299 subscription. Oh yeah. So you pay 299 subscription for a game that may not be good. Unparamatic creator. Has mass. And we have another one. Hogwarts Legacy. Second most pre ordered game at three. Every trans person being physically affected by this game. This is a last time I've been addressing this. It's basically here. And basically here. And people are not getting, you know, the people are like, you have this one here. All you have to do is read it. But yeah. Basically, I'm a 26 year old Vatina who of trans experience. I've seen a lot of hate directed towards people who want to play this game. What if we can put the LGBT community who are giving way forward? But, like, what's wrong with looking forward to playing the game? Okay. Like, I could play the, like, get the past, or, why are you excited for, uh, Bird Diamond Side Poets? The same games as the first game, but why are you excited for Fortnite skins? Okay. But, if you like Harry Potter, you should be allowed to like the game. Okay, this is Joker all over again. Harry Potter Hogwarts Legacy is Joker 2.0. A month before Joker came out, there were all of these things that Joker would start violence or Joker, and then there was a review bombing by the critics for Joker. Okay, even though it was one of the best movies of the year, but no, 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 no. Joker is a horrible movie that caused absolutely zero violence. Okay, but. You know, good for a tough conversation, you know, here, blah, 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 here. You know, and that's about Harry Potter. Yeah. You know. Yeah. You know. Yeah, you know, we gotta go here. You know. I can't wait till this game comes out, really. Because. I'm not gonna buy it. I'm not gonna play this game or buy this game. Basically, I'm, I don't have any interest in Harry Potter. But then I was like, "Oh, cool to make it a Harry Potter game." That's basically what I said. I, I'm happy for Harry Potter fans that they finally get a big game. Okay. Here. Yeah. And here are the top ones. These are the top comments. Yeah. You know. Here we go. Anyway, who has made this clear? Anyone who buys Hogwarts Legacy by playing out directly making her feel more validated and helps keep the anti trans ventures. Okay. She has her own opinions. That's apparently wrong in this world. You know. That's apparently wrong. Okay. If you're wondering how Actman feels about trans people, wondering how he's talking about Hogwarts Legacy in his replies. <laughs> yeah, and this is, you know, the, the so-called boycott for this game is just so ridiculous. Okay. They, you're making this game sound more. Even people who don't like Harry Potter... I'm not, I'm not a person who likes Harry Potter. I'm, I watched the first two movies when I was like, I'm like, I don't really like this that much. And, yeah. Here we go. Remind us of a safe place for my community. I will stand with my trans friends and will not be touching Hogwarts Legacy at all. Be F 
JK Rowling. Anyways, love, you all stay safe. Yeah, you probably have a... Oh, it's a VTuber. Yeah, VTubers. You know, in terms of opinions, VTubers probably don't matter because they're AI. Okay. <laughs> and Harry Potter, Hogwarts Legacy, despite the so-called boycott of the game, is the best-selling game on Steam. Yep. <laughs> you know, right? despite all the backlash, the, all, all the pointless backlash this game's getting, it's still the best-selling game on Steam. Probably the most people old game on Xbox. Both flat standing codes and most people old game. Because this game's coming to the Switch as well. On Switch. Probably the most, Okay, probably on Switch besides Breath of the Wild. Tears of the Kingdom. Okay, probably besides Tears of the Kingdom. I think that's the only game that probably has more people than, than Hogwarts Legacy on the Switch. Uh, probably the most people old game on the PlayStation 4, PS5, and Xbox Series X, and Xbox One. Yeah. Fred V. Ryder. Uh, you know. <laughs> effort hate Harry Potter. I will be touching Hogwarts Legacy because JK Wall, we're gonna be too much money spent towards JK Wall, and I refuse to do that. <laughs> and here you go, this is another one. My request to you all, please don't support Hogwarts Legacy. And of course, the guy looks like a. I mean, but you're not supposed to make fun of people's appearances in 2023. You're not! He looks like a Discord mod. <laughs> he looks like a Discord mod. <laughs> Like, this whole thing is so stupid. Okay. And I'm going to this was an every Harry Potter fan. Oh, here's another one. Yes, and you are tough. And I have said it a few times to take the rainbow out of your profile. If you want to play a game that's anti Semitic, you know what that makes you? Oh, yeah. If you play the new Harry Potter game, you are anti Jewish. Yep. If you play the new Harry Potter game, or pre-order the game, or touch the game, or even breathe on the game, you're anti-trans, and you're anti-Semitic. Okay. You know... Play... <laughs> Apparently, J.K. Rowling's been so fake trans always willing to put money on the mouth, so... So instead of buying Hogwarts Legacy, I'll be using money to donate to cars and buy an actual good game, like Kirby's Return to Dream on Baby. Well, I'm getting Kirby's Return to Dream on Dorks, I, I, I'm getting that game. So, but again, this person at least is reasonable like right, the others, but really, this is just so stupid. <laughs> it's a video game, it doesn't affect anyone, and only that affects, there'll be more this game. You're not fighting for anything by boycotting this game. You're not boycotting, you're not fighting anything. Same thing with the, uh... If you watch over, you're not, you're not fighting anything, you're just supporting companies, okay? You're not, you're not support. you know, you're supporting a really bad show that really nobody likes, and it's deeply unpopular among everyone in the cat, okay? And Hogwarts Legacy is probably the polar opposite. It's probably going to be one of the most, unless the game comes out to be a gritty and buggy mess, mess, then there'll be a whole bunch of videos about how the game is bad because it's a gritty and buggy mess. But if the game turns out to be good for the Harry Potter community. <laughs> oh yeah, do you know the biggest hypocrisy of this is? Harry Potter Hogwarts Legacy will allow you for trans characters. So, for a game that's supposedly anti-trans, for a game that is supposed to be against transgender people. Why are you? Why is the game allowing you to play as transgender people? This is, you know, again, this is why people don't like, you know, Twitter. Okay, Twitter is good and bad at the same time. You get, it's fun to watch the meltdowns as well. I'm about to mute the word Hogwarts Legacy. <laughs> I like this one. You know, it's just people bringing from now we need to get some oh, fun not play the video game. <laughs> I 
And the game is coming out above. Okay, this game is coming out above on PC, Xbox Series X, and PS5. They're really starting to diss the last generation of the consoles. Okay. They're really starting to get stitched the last gen consoles. Uh, you know. That's why you don't really. You know, the new Star Wars games, next set exclusive Starfield, next set exclusive Octo, next set exclusive. I think the next Spider Man game is next set exclusive. And even then, a lot of the games that'll come out of last set consoles are either indie games or anime games. Games that nobody will buy, you know, in that category. Basically, what I'm saying is Silverwell and a few other, and a few stragglers, okay? <laughs> and, here's another, and here's another one. Congrats on your donation to actively harm strategy. Oh, yeah. Playing a game is actively, actively harming a group of people. Even though in the game, you can play as trans people in the game. You can make your character trans. But this doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Okay. I, I, I'm, I'm confused by this. Okay. I don't like Harry Potter. Because I don't like the story of Harry Potter. It's not, it's not my thing. Okay. Harry Potter is not my thing. But the fact that you're going around. And attacking people. For why the game. And calling them. It's in phobes. Otherwise I forget anti-Semitic. If you do buy the game. And you're trans. Well, they're not going to find a new excuse to attack you. And then they'll start calling you anti-Semitic, which is no proof that Hogwarts Legacy is racist towards Jewish people. Okay. No evidence. Yeah, and we can go out the latest. Okay. For people who complain about Hogwarts Legacy, <laughs> your boy got his point with it's a game. It doesn't hurt anyone. All you write is just telling people to buy it. While you're doing one stop trans violence, protest these places. Okay. These are the map of countries that criminalize LGBT people. These are all the countries that criminalize it. Including, you know, but... No, no, no. Well, you know, kind of like with the meat video I talked about yesterday. The meat video. The video about meat. You know... Which, you know... I can understand if you're telling people that eat meat, you know, three meals a day. You know, steak, you know. Of course, they gotta have some variety in their diet. But telling people that they can't eat meat at all is the most ridiculous argument. This is another very ridiculous argument. Okay, it's just a game. Okay, oh yeah, 70 days until the trans, I can't say that word, takes place. No, Harry Potter Hogwarts Legacy is not going to do harm to anyone. Okay. <laughs> Here, this is a game. It's coming out in a month. Okay. This may basically describe Twitter perfectly. Okay. You know. You brought Hogwarts IZ. Do you know that's transforming? Do you know the reason why RZ is he just more minority and he is offended? You know, I need to boycott this game of Hogwarts IZ. You know, it's more yeah. Quit having fun. <laughs> like, this is a game. Okay. Oh, yeah. I, don't, I can go over the ridiculous that thing that video games cause now. It's what's... That, that has been disproven. Video games cause violence, that has been disproven already, okay? It has been disproven, but yeah. I think we're done with the toxic set that's Twitter for today. Goodbye.